Hey guys, Jarchunks21 here. So, you guys liked our last uh, GTA 5 series, known as the MP series. Now, we are playing the FIB Operation Falcon series, is what this is called. Operation Falcon. A joint task force between the FIB, including the lead agent, Agent Cooper here, the lead agents of the F AFE, the Alcohol, Firearms, and Explosives Agency, the Bureau of Alcohol, Firearms, and Explosives, and the DIS, the Department of Interior Security. This operation deals solely with capturing and detaining gang members and hunting down illegal firearms. So, we're going to get started here. Uh, my little guy right here is going to get his... All of his gear ready. And of course, we have other things to show you before we get started, of course. Um, so, I'm going to go ahead and get started on this. And come down here to, uh, it's not there. Come down here to the lovely little garage station here pick up my body armor that is just one feature of this lovely mod is that you are able to be called out on missions or on uh, jobs we go ahead and fix that for you guys so we don't have that blaring in the background F4 give weapon combat pistol and I will show off each of these lovely new toys here in a second. Give weapon. If we need any other uh, special weapons and explosives, I will fill out the reports to get them. But in the meantime, no good federal agent would be without his Glock. Glock 17. And the M4, which will never be used like that because the scope doesn't work on it. It doesn't change the sound of the weapon, unfortunately, but it does make a nice sound. Now, uh, today is going to be a pretty slow day, uh, so I apologize for that. The AFE has requested that we go to each uh, of the ammunitions, and starting with these two here in Los Santos with the gun range, and see if we can figure out what's going on. Because some of the weapons these gangbangers have been using uh, are high grade. Go ahead and turn that siren off. We don't need the siren, we just need the lights. Through the light. And of course this, uh, for those of you guys, I will let you guys know when I'm in character. I was just in character. Whenever this pops up, I'm out of character. Uh, this is what I have to use. So it has some limitations, because I can't use mod menu with, uh, with rage hook. I can't use my mod menu. Which also means we're not really able to see how fast I'm going. So no one is here. That's odd. Let's go ahead and shoot down these cameras for our uh, forensic unit.
Hello and welcome to the other game you nation to check it out. Uh, on our way back, we'll swing by the Vagos territory and see what we can figure out there. That is just one of the many features of this uh, mod, is the fact that we are able to take down hostile combatants. Now, if anyone's in there, they've heard us. So let's, uh, let's full play this up a little bit. Come over here, get my M4 out of the back. No one here either. I hate TV. Occasionally we will break roleplay uh, and do random little shenanigans. And he's gone. Sorry. Just hoping for a tip. Okay, let's head over here to check out the Vagos. Reports are that they've been messing in on Balas and the family's territories. About a couple minutes ago, there was a reported shooting in the area, so let's get a go. Let's go see what we can figure out. That's Big Dave over there, the leader of the Vagos. Let's go see what he has to say today. Tim Mason. Back here. Taser, taser, taser.
Don't move. That is not good. For nothing. So the Vagos didn't give us anything apparently. Hold on. 10:51. Go ahead. 10:4. So we just get a report that uh, this gun shop over here said some shady-looking characters in the area. We'll see if we can get there before those people leave. Am I? Some units sent over towards it. But yeah, uh, Operation Falcon is meant to be a task force between myself and the FIB, with the AFE and the uh, DIS. Both of those other agencies are pretty secretive. I mean, the AFE is mostly for undercover work, and the DIS, they don't show up when shit really gets ugly. Like uh, with that case with that FIB agent who was completely... DIS showed up and completely took over the whole FIB building for the course of the investigation. This is one of those things where, you know, interagency cooperation is key solely due to the fact that these guys are incredibly dangerous and quite possibly deadly. I mean, we had a report that uh, a couple of the Vagos were shooting off some fucking homing launchers, some homing launchers, which is incredibly dangerous and could potentially cause a great deal of destruction. I mean, these are common criminals with military-grade weapons. Incredibly dangerous to let them just wander around with them. There he is. That's the guy right there. Supposedly wearing blue jeans, black shirt, black male.
Furio of Barati. Furio of Where's the weapons at, bud? Come on, where are they? Look, if you don't tell me where they are, we're gonna take you in. Okay, fine. You want that? I'm good with that. Let's go. On the ground. Whoops, sorry about that, bud. Local transport is here to pick you up. All yours, boys. You come down to the station, get some answers out of him. Okay. Well, I guess we're going to head up here to Zancudo and see what we can figure out. MPs are reporting uh, use of military grade weapons near the base. No need to go code for this. We'll, uh, we'll be able to go stealth style. Point of contact is supposed to be a colonel here on the base. So we can get in to talk with him. Colonel's not here. Let's turn around and go and, uh... So we can find him over at the watchtower. Supposedly there's some people taking um, illegal weapons here. There used to be illegal weapons near the base. So let's see if we can get the answer. Of course, they still have to fix that damned elevator here at the base. God, you'd think the government would be able to pay these guys enough to fix their fucking elevator, you know? Of course, being on a military base, we're not allowed to carry guns, so... As you guys can see on my holster there, I don't have my fire, my sidearm with me. That's a shame. You know, every military guy likes to shoot a Glock. So, let's go up here and talk to the general. See if we can get some answers for the colonel I don't, I don't really remember. I believe he's somewhat of high rank here on the base. Supposedly he's up here in the air traffic control tower. He's seen a couple of people shooting rockets at his aircraft. Let's just bypass that right there. Hold on. Yeah, Colonel. Yep. 
Really now? Okay, thank you. Well, we'll pick this up tomorrow, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed the first episode of Operation Falcon. See you guys next time.